The following is a semi-professional... Ah, fuck it. Read it yourself. All Welcome right. back to Not How Ha. If I hey, seem... Hey, everybody. <laughs> if I seem unenthusiastic, it's because we checked the footage from our last episodes. Our last three episodes that we made. We're going to be releasing that audio file by itself with just a slate that says animate me. Um, it'll be free. Uh, we won't make any moolah off of that. Yeah, we're not um, We're not going to try and monetize it. But what... Uh, we're going to release it under Creative Commons so you guys can do whatever the hell you want with it. But it's only three episodes, and what's kind of cool, too, is it was just Neil dying a lot. Uh, we're through the tunnel now, and we're starting on the next section, so... Y yay? Yeah. It's great. <laughs> no, we're going to be happy. We're excited. Fuck Are you. you. Alive, awake, alert, enthusiastic. That's copyrighted. Is it? So is the birthday song. God damn it. Yeah, that's why you hear for He's a Jolly Good Fellow. Press the any key. In all the movies. Yes, I'm going to press the any key and start this ridiculous trap of shit. Why should we hesitate? Let's shoot this red spot. So the part dancing. you miss is at the end of the tunnel, uh, a little like quick time event happens where these guys kick so the shit out of you. These are Nazis so that captured me. I'll watch this peak till then. So these guys are getting ready to kill me because I'm clearly Russian. Ooh. The old boot stomp. Yep. Good point. All right, you red scout. Offer a prayer to your Marx or whoever. <laughs> they don't sound very German. No, that's because they're still in Russia. They're just Russian. They're just fucking uh, German sympathizers, basically. It's like neo Nazis. Our neo Nazis are not German. So, like, was this like Super Spetsnaz dude that just came in? These are Spartans. Oh, so. They're gonna see the fucking dog tag and they're gonna be like, oh shit, Hunter's dead. But like, look, see, Sparta's you written know, all over his fucking like about the yeah. bad guys, There's always a lot of discussion before they get around to pulling the trigger. So basically, super fucking, Spetsnaz? Fucking lampshading. Yeah, no, these guys are definitely the good guys, and Spetsnaz wishes they were this hardcore, because Spetsnaz still has to fight humans at the end of the day. You owe me one. These yeah. guys fight monsters with like knives, rat. because what they the think it's fun. You? That's Hunter's token. What can they do? I'd better you take it from your axe, bro. Whatever message you have, save it for him. <sighs> Did you watch the cutscene just now, Tyler? That was just a leaping knife attack. Okay. But I feel like Wait, you can do a front flip axe. That's nice. Seriously? In real life. These guys, yeah, they yep. keep the little hatchets okay. and they do Let's a front move to the armor car. And throw it, hit a target. It's it's because like okay, as Papa, much as I the love plan. the American You'll military take the armor because car to our real car. you know our boys that, are we'll real close, over the there the fighting station. for corporate interests. Don't what don't lie to yourselves. They're not fighting for freedom as much as they're fighting for corporate interests. Sorry. Sorry to get all real and politicky on you guys, but like that's the truth. Because we say all the time this isn't a political show. Yeah. Right. But, like, seriously, the Russians are better trained. They are. They fucking, they train from, like, 16 when they sign up for the military. And they train for, like, fucking two years before they're allowed to even go out into the army. So, it, like, most of our elite special forces. Yeah. Like the SEALs, Delta Force, Marine Force. Research. Yeah, yeah, those elite special forces that don't even get fucking activated until the president gives a phone call like, Hey, we got a 20 on Bin Laden! And then they spend 30 minutes making sure that they're beautiful before they actually fucking get geared up and go. Well, yeah, I mean, that's because... Declassified missions. That, yeah, and America has rules. That's always been our thing, is we got a lot of rules, man. And we have safety stand-downs. So, safety briefs might make us seem less cool. All I know is that the only SEAL that I care about on a day-to-day -day basis, like... Chris Kyle, or whatever his name is, the sniper, like, he was a pretty cool dude. He embellished a whole bunch of shit um, that he wrote about in his book. Well, but, I mean, if I was going to write an autobiography about myself, I would embellish it. Yeah, but, like... I'd be, like, uh, 10-inch dick, fucking super beautiful. Yeah, but That's then kind of just the nature of but then telling you've, war stories. But then you've got Demo Dick Marchenko, who the Navy actually said, like, you're not allowed to release another chapter of your book because it's fucking shaming the Navy. And, like... When somebody asked him about it, he's like, "Yeah, I guess uh, I guess they didn't like hearing about the fact that I actually captured an admiral from his fucking quarters, and like they couldn't they couldn't call slander on it. 
because that admiral advocated, like, yeah, it really happened. He fucking got past all of my security forces and took me from the same house twice, like, while under guard. What admiral was this? I don't remember his fucking name, but De uh, Demo Dick Marchenko, uh, Richard Marchenko, or Marchenko, however it's pronounced. Oh, um, so this is a real story? Yeah, um, the character Jack Ryan from Tom Clancy's books is loosely based on him. Um, I said, I think it's Jack Ryan. Uh, no, you're talking about the Navy SEAL character. Yeah. I uh, fuck. I C forget. Um, but it, as it turns out, Clancy and Marchenko are really good buddies. Or were until Clancy unfortunately died. By the way, everybody, this is Tyler, uh, hey. our Marine buddy that we talk about all the time. He's he's actually in the audio that we're releasing for the three episodes we lost that I'm totally not bitter about. Oh, cool. Amazon approved that payment for the noose. The pre-tied noose that I ordered. John Clark. You should manage okay. it. Okay, thank you for wikiing that, because I'm almost certain we did that. Yeah. I hope you know how to right. <laughs> I did read the book Without Remorse, which was an well, outstanding guys, read. Good luck to you. John Clark was the main character, but his name is too generic. Yeah. To commit to memory. John Everyman! <laughs> it really is too, like, it is way too samey for how badass of a character it is. Like, Sam Fisher is a kind of a, really kind of a samey name also, but like, you remember it well because of the fucking video games and everything that happens in the video games. And of course, Mike Blyard's eyes. We'll try to get past the roadblocks quietly. How do you the feel about, ty uh, about Blacklist, that Tyler? Red. Because a lot of people Standing were really upset that Ironside was not the voice of Fisher. I wasn't upset that lost the voice of Mike Blyard's side, but I mean, the gameplay kind of made up for it. And they stated they were going in a new direction. And it was supposed to be a younger kind of Sam Fisher, I guess. And it didn't really make sense anymore. Mike Lyonside, what, in his late 60s? I honestly don't know. I don't Early know. Early 70s? And I, I don't know. I mean, Sam Fisher's getting there, too. If they would have continued the story, uh, I mean, he would have been in his late... Sam Fisher would have been late 50s. <laughs> Tactical <would've>, Walker. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So they kind of had to kind of rewind it and bring it to a younger Sam Fisher. Oh, I'm not, I'm not saying that they, you know, didn't have to, like, restart it or rewind or, like, retcon things or anything like that. You mean just use the voice again? I think Ironside probably could have done it, but he, in an interview they did, I believe he even was in agreement that it was good to take it in a new direction. And So we talked over, uh, I think that's Miller underneath me there. Uh, we talked over him saying, uh, honk the horn to get us through the barricade. I completely missed that, and I forgot that I could even honk the horn on this thing. Wait, honking the horn is the, like, the challenge? Yeah. The fast raise there? Yeah, to open the gate. Yeah. Great security. Well, it's kind of like, uh... These are fascist troops? Oh, boy. What are you doing out here? This vehicle, it's not on the transport. Well, it's kind of like, you know... Oh, boy. Uh, We've been Han Solo to talking about how he didn't want to, you know, Harrison Ford talk about not wanting to do Star ammo. Wars every, anymore. They like everybody was talking about, spoiler alert, how he how he died, and he was just kind of like, I, I don't want to do this shit anymore. There we go. <laughs> Get him. My goodness. <laughs> so, card battle? <laughs> yep. Card battle. <laughs> Whoa, Jesus! <laughs> yeah, what do you think these things are run on, man? Streams and starlight? Yeah, no. Gasoline. <laughs> Stub away from gasoline. <laughs> yeah, but it's got like a little lawnmower motor on it. <laughs> that thing fucking exploded. That's a shitload of gas in me. Enemy on left! Oh boy. Oh man. <laughs> well, I just love how slow these things move. Enemy on left! Oh fuck. Hey man, accuracy through aggregation? That's the American way. 
I know, we're in Russia. I get it. We're supposed to be in Russia. I guess you can heal right now. Nope. Nope. I, I heal with, by fucking the magical... Health, like regrowth syndrome. Yeah, the magical health fairies. My healing factor kicks in uh, when I stop taking damage. Dry honk the horn. There. I, hon I honk the horn. Oh, yeah. How about that shit? Dude, it worked. <laughs> This gun's amazing and never runs out of bullets. That box must be jam-packed with bullets. That's what the explosions are, the fucking ammunition, the fucking cash. Enemy from the back. Again. Oh man. Enemy from the back. Yes, I see them. Thank you, Miller. <clears throat> Kinda sounds like a tie dude. Uh. Please line up in the back! For the boat? <laughs> Do you want to go to the flyway monkey? Oh, Jesus. Alright, so there's a tank on rails here. Okay. Oh, oh, oh Jesus. Oh, my God. It's a Panzer. Panzer Faust. Yep. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Can you shoot him? The rockets? No. Yeah. I oh. wish. That rocket turned down the did you hear the? Did you hear the fucking engine stop? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. This uh -oh. is gonna get. This is gonna get fun. Well, on the next episode, we see how much more fun it can get.